Yes, now everyone, welcome back to another Asian Cup Predicts video. Match day two of the competition starts tonight with China taking on Lebanon. Let's get into the predictions and see who we think is going to win this week. All right, like I said, first round of match day two is Lebanon taking on China. China picking up a point in their last game against Tajikistan and Lebanon going down 3-0 to the host Qatar. And I'm going to go with China in this one. I think they showed a lot more potential than Lebanon in their last game. And I think they come out on top in this one. Game two of match day two is the two other teams from Group A, Tajikistan and Qatar. Qatar, they looked pretty good in that first game against Lebanon, and I don't see them choking up in this one against a Tajikistan side that wasn't overly impressive against China. So I think the people have got this right. 95% of people will pick Qatar, and I'm going to as well. Match three and the Socceroos are back in action this time against Syria, who didn't look overly convincing against Uzbekistan last time out. They did hold Uzbekistan to a nil or draw, and I think Australia will play a bit more with freedom. I think Riley McGrew should come in and start, for, in my opinion, but I think we pick up the win again in this one, and I think we go top of the group and maybe even push our way into the round of 16 already. And then game four is India taking on Uzbekistan. Uzbekistan held to that nil or draw, like I said, against Syria last time out. And India defended well against Australia, especially in that first half. But I think Uzbekistan will be too much of a task for them, like the Australians were. And I'm going to go for an Uzbekistani win. I think 87% of people have picked it and I'm going to as well. On to the next game, which is Palestine taking on the UAE. Palestine lost 4-1 last time out against Iran, and UAE beat Hong Kong last time out. And I think UAE pick up another result in this one. I think it could be a couple of goals to nil, maybe. Maybe Palestine get on the score sheet like they did against Iran last time out, but UAE for me. Next game up is Iraq taking on Japan. Japan, one of the favorites, but there was a bit of a hiccup last time out. They only won 4-2 against Vietnam, conceding two goals to a side like Vietnam. Probably not something that Japan wants to do too often in Iraq beating Indonesia 3-1. But Japan, for me, I think they've got too much class and they'll just overcome anything the Iraqis can throw at them and Japan will win this one quite comfortably. Next game up is Vietnam taking on Indonesia, two teams that lost their opening fixture. Vietnam losing 4-2 to Japan and Indonesia losing 3-1-2. Next game up is Hong Kong taking on Iran. Iran should be winning this one quite easily. They won last time out 4-1 against Palestine. Hong Kong, the lowest rated nation in this Asian Cup. They lost 3-1 to the UAE, so Iran quite comfortably for me in this one. On to Jordan versus the Korea Republic. Last time out, South Korea beat Bahrain 3-1. And Jordan, they beat Malaysia 4-0. Very convincing display. I don't think they can keep that up against the strong South Korean side in this one, though. I'm going to go South Korea. I think it could be quite comfortable. I'm going to go with the 91% who's picked South Korea in this one. Next up, Bahrain taking on Malaysia. Two teams that lost their opening fixture, like I just said. Bahrain losing to South Korea and Malaysia losing to Jordan. This could be a very close game. I want to take Malaysia, a bit of an upset, but I'm going to go with the draw in this one. I don't think these two teams will be split that much, so draw for me. Penultimate game of match day two, it's Oman taking on Thailand. Thailand, they beat Kazakhstan 2-0 last time out, and Oman only lost to Saudi Arabia 2-1, so that's a positive result for, result for Oman, and I think they pick up the win in this one. Even though Thailand got the result last time out, I think Oman will be too strong, and I think they'll pick up the win, maybe a 3-1 or something like that. And final game of match day two, it's the Kazakhstan taking on Saudi Arabia. Saudi Arabia, one of the favorites for this tournament, and for good reason. Although they didn't look too convincing last time out against Oman, I'm going to take them for the win in this one. Could be 4 or 5 nil. That's how good I rate Saudi Arabia at the moment. Bit of a hiccup last time out, like I said, but they should be no, Kazakhstan should be no match for Saudi Arabia. And there we go. There are my predictions for match day two of the Asian Cup. Let me know your predictions down in the comments below. Thank you all for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe. And until next time, I'll see you soon.